now let us solve a problem based on the principal stresses and the stresses on inclined plane so here we have a problem uh, this is a section on which shear stresses of 6000 psi is acting and uh, the normal stress on the x axis is 4000 psi and on the y axis is 8000 psi now let's write them down because this is on uh, normal to the plane perpendicular to the x axis so we can write sigma x is equal to 4000 psi all right I write this positive okay 4000 because here it is in tension right it is away from the plane this 4000 therefore this is tension here Sigma Y is equal to minus 8000 PSI right because this 8000 is acting towards the plane and here in this side too it's trying to compress the plane therefore it is negative right now the shear stress is 6000 psi i can write shear stress as sigma xy let it be shear stress equal to 6000 psi now we are required to find the principal stress here and the stress on inclined plane. Let, let us first find the principal stresses. Now we know principal stresses. Principal stresses there are of two types. One is major, and another is minor principal stress. All right. Now major principal stress is found using sigma x is equal to sorry sigma 1 is equal to sigma x plus sigma y divided by 2 plus whole under root of sigma x minus sigma y divided by 2 square plus tau xy square okay now we have to put uh, sigma x which is equal to what 4000 psi Sigma y is what minus eight thousand psi and shear stress tau xy equal six thousand psi. Okay, that's it. Now when we put these values and I will use the calculator, we find sigma one is equal to let me use a calculator. we found sigma 1 is equal to 6485.3 psi All right this is sigma 1 now we have to find the minor principal stress it is denoted by let's say sigma 2 which is same as this but except here Will be minus okay so better is i will copy all of this here here we had to change it into mines right now again when you 
when you will put all the values here you will get sigma 2 when you will put sigma x as 4000 psi uh, sigma y as minus 8000 psi tau xy as 6000 psi what you will get we will get sigma 2 using the calculator let me use this let me use the calculator we get sigma 2 equal to minus 10485.3 psi all right so we found the minor principal stress is this and the major principal stress is this this is the major principal stress now what else we have to find Now we have to find stresses on an inclined plane by 30 degrees counterclockwise from x axis. Let's, let me show you here. Counterclockwise from x face, all right. Now this is the x face, right? This one is the x face. When you go counterclockwise, right? Anti clockwise, you have to draw. A plane like this which is inclined at an angle of how much 30 degrees right now what is the formula to find that now the uh, let me write that here Let me write that here. Uh, stress on an inclined plane by 30 degrees. Again, the stress is of two types. One is normal stress, another is shear stress let us denote this by sigma x star and this by uh, tau x y star now this sigma normal stress this sigma x y it is found with the formula sigma x star is equal to sigma x plus sigma y divided by 2 plus sigma x minus sigma y by 2 cos 2 theta plus tau xy sine of to theta all right now let, when you put the values again in this when you put sigma x is how much 4000 sigma y is minus 8000 theta is 30 degrees and tau xy is 6000 right when you put all these values in the calculator uh, you will find sigma x as let me use a calculator you will find sigma x to be 6196 approximately 6196 psi now here this is the normal stress. Now, the shear stress is found like this.
let me write here tau x y star is equal to minus sigma x minus sigma y by 2 sine 2 theta minus tau x y cos 2 theta sorry this is plus tau x y cos 2 theta now again when you will put here sigma x how much 4000 sigma y as minus 8000 theta as 30 degrees tau x y as 6000 psi when you will put all these values in the calculator you will get tau star x y is equal to let me use the calculator i found tau x y star to be 2196 psi approximately so here we find the normal stress on the inclined plane the normal stress is this and the shear stress on this inclined plane is this all right so that's it again you will find the notes of this lecture in the description and also if you have any problems please contact me thank you